there's the guy that wants the girl. That thinks the girl wants the other guy. But really, she wants the guy. Matthew, words can't even begin to describe how excited I am for today, the day we have dreamt about for the last two years. I have imagined this day since I was a little girl, and I'd like to start by just telling you how much I love you and how much I love the life that we are building together. I don't think this day will solidify our love. My love for you solidified the moment we took flight in that hot air balloon. The moment I realized I would do anything for you. <laughs> Two years, 20 years, 100. I can't think of a better way to spend it than with you. first started seeing each other, I remember telling you that I was content with how my life was and how it would take someone truly remarkable for me to change it. You are truly remarkable and everything I wished for in another person. Matthew, when we first met, if you told me that we would be standing here today, I would say you were crazy, mostly because you were in the friend zone. <laughs> I went out to this restaurant with my buddy and I was actually setting her up with him. So I wrote his phone number down on the receipt. Well, uh, fast forward like a year and a half and their relationship just didn't pan out. About a year later, I remember going to meet you and your friends when you finally came home from your first deployment, and you embraced me in that first hug, and you spun me around before putting me back down. I think I fell in love with you in that moment, even though I wouldn't realize it until much later. Matthew is kind, he is hysterical, he is intentional, he cares so much about other people and he is selfless and he just puts so many people in front of himself. When we first got Katie, um, she fit right in as one of my princesses. You know, you've become the woman that I uh, always knew you were. <laughs> you killing it, girl. Oh, yeah, you think so? <laughs> oh, my lovely daddy. I love you too. Mm -hmm. Katie and Matthew met in Virginia, and we weren't we weren't really a part of that. And when the first time we met Katie, we were introduced to her as Matthew's roommate's girlfriend. And I looked at my wife. I, I said, "Why isn't she Matthew's girlfriend?" I don't know how to adequately express how much I love you, but I am fortunate enough to have the rest of my life to show you. You look beautiful. Thank you. Oh my God. <laughs> you look gorgeous. Thank you. Oh my Thank God. You, baby. I prayed for a man who would be unyieldingly patient and kind. I prayed for a man with a pure heart and unparalleled intentionality. 
I prayed for a soulmate. And you were mm. not kidding me. You do look like Cinderella. Oh, you look beautiful. Thank you. Oh my God. Everything will be okay, sweetheart. Marriage is an, an amazing thing. To get to spend the rest of your life with someone is not daunting. It's uplifting, like a hot air balloon. It's strengthening. It's friendship and it's growth. When you love someone unconditionally and you take a leap of faith and decide to spend the rest of your lives with them, it's all or nothing. It's really, really simple. You fight for each other, you love each other, and you never give up. In here, matters a whole lot more than what's out here. I vow to give you a kiss every morning that I wake up before I leave for work. When you are stressed and the world appears to be falling around you, I vow to tell you that everything will be okay and do my absolute best to make it that way. I vow to always fight for us, for the, I know that we together will build a life far better than either of us could have a part. By the power vested in the state of Hawaii, I now pronounce you a man and a wife. You may kiss the bride. Matt and I have known each other for over 10 years. We've known each other since high school, commissioned together, and that's where our paths diverged. <laughs> Fast forward a few years, and I'm underway on deployment, and we're seeing prospective sailors and officers show up to the ship. Sure enough, I see my old friend, Matty J. I asked Matt if he was dating anyone, and he said, yeah, man. So I started asking, what's your name? What's you do? Sweetie, I didn't think you were real for a very long time. <laughs> Once we got back from deployment, I finally did meet Kate, and I was so surprised. One, she was real, and two, I saw that she's a lovely, cheerful, and kind-hearted woman that truly does love me. Katie is simply just a fun and bubbly person. <laughs> And it really warms your heart when you see true love. I'm talking real love. When you see two people who genuinely love each other and care for one another. And I don't mean the silly puppy love that comes with infatuation. I mean the kind of love that comes only with time together and what time brings with it. They truly already know what it's like to be man and wife, to have an eternal partner. In these bodies we will live, in these bodies we will die, and where you invest your love, you invest your life. Cheers. Ladies and gentlemen, it is my great honor to present to you for the very first time, after two years and three days, Mr. and Mrs. Matthew and Katie Johnson. <laughs>